Georgia was at the center of Trump's effort to overturn the election, and that's why the state stays in the news. The Supreme Court just handed a big loss to Lindsey Graham, ruling he must testify in that Georgia probe. Now, newly leaked emails show Trump's lawyers had a strategy, hoping Thomas might be their only chance to overthrow Trump's loss on the Supreme Court because he oversees appeals out of Georgia. Here's the quote. Our only chance to get a favorable judicial opinion by January 6th, which could hold up the Georgia count in Congress, is from Thomas. That's what one Trump lawyer wrote. While the coup lawyer, John Eastman, replied, I agree, it may be enough to kick the Georgia legislature into gear. That's the same John Eastman whose phone was later seized by the FBI and pled the fifth over a hundred times facing Congress. Is that statement in this memo true? Yes. President Trump authorized you to discuss publicly your January 4th, 2021 conversation with him. Yes. But you will not discuss those same conversations with this committee. Fifth, 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 and a phone search. Eastman has a lot of legal problems. These leaks, though, they put heat on him because they show the intent was long after the states were done and the Electoral College met, the intent was still to steal the election. Whatever phone those agents sees is being reviewed by the authorities. And as for the line in here, this is important in terms of what just leaked. This line, kick the Georgia legislator into gear. Well, that doubles all the way back to the top of the White House, where Donald Trump wanted to abuse DOJ power to try to force Georgia's legislature back into session to steal the race. It sounds outlandish, unlikely, even those local Republicans weren't willing to do it. But the emails show how high this plot went. And if people in the White House were trying to literally do that, at what point do they have criminal liability in Georgia? That's the big question. We'll stay on it.